This is the third attempt to make this video. Actually, the fourth. Um, anyway, how I brush clear brushing lacquer on my guitars. Got some lacquer here. Got uh, some thinner here. Got my crazy neighbor banging on the door of uh, their tenant downstairs looking for looking for something. I don't even know what because they're not speaking English. But um, in any event, so to get started, I've already done the sides. Um, I thin the lacquer because I think it helps the flow out. Um, and it, that's my opinion. I've done uh, five guitars like this. The, the one that I did without thinning was pretty difficult to get a smooth finish. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear my neighbor, but they're going bananas. Something about child support. Neither here nor there. Anyway. So, I just pretty much brush it on. Um, you don't, really don't want to mess with it too much once you put it on. I overlap the rows a little bit. I also start here and go out so I don't um, pull the lacquer off the brush and get giant drips down the side. So, that's pretty much it. Um, now that I'm brushing it on, I think I've diluted it a little too much. Um, might take a few more coats than I would like to get um, a good, good coverage on here. But anyway, that's it. You definitely can um, can see that I'm messing with it a lot more than I usually do. But if you don't thin the lacquer, you cannot mess with it once you make a stroke. You put the stroke on, and then that's pretty much it because this does skin over extremely fast. So, you can see that I have plenty of brush strokes. It is not smooth. I even have bubbles here, which those will go away. And um, that's about it. I'm going to flip it over to the top. I got it clamped in my bench vise with a handle attached to it. That should be um, that should be it. So if you have any other questions or any questions, don't hesitate to ask. This, by the way, is Claro Walnut um, Curly Mahogany Binding. You can see even with one coat of lacquer, it really, really perks up the wood, makes it look very nice. Sealed it with Z-Poxy. And, uh, and that's it. Thanks.